Welcome to Chhatrapati Shivaji International Airport in Mumbai where the local time is 5 minutes past 2. What's up? So I'm traveling from Los Angeles to Mumbai today and I just finished my super epic Colorado road trip. In case you have missed my daily vlog from Colorado, here is the link. Go ahead and check it out. So I'm traveling today from Los Angeles to Mumbai in Emirates A3 the business class and since it's a long 20 hours flight, I don't, I mean I hate sitting idle in the flight so I thought why not just go ahead and make a detailed video about the business class in A380. So here is my review. So Emirates A380 is, I mean the Airbus A380 is the biggest passenger airline in the world. It flies with almost more than 500 passengers like 400 economy, 70 or 80 business and like 20 first class. Huge aircraft and whenever I'm traveling to any part of the world I normally always look for a route which has the Emirates A380 flying because I just love it man. And I've already done a video about it, why Emirates A380 is the winner for me. I did a video about it when I was traveling from India to US in the economy. So in case you missed the video, here's the link, go ahead and check it out. So the Emirates A380 has like three classes. One is the economy, second is the business, and the third is first class. Top of the economy is the one where you sit with everyone. Business, you have a private space and yeah, private seat. And first class, you have a private cabin all together for Gapa Gap. And here is a disclaimer, before you go mad at me for speaking all the good things about Emirates A380, let me tell you, this video is not sponsored by Emirates or they have not told me anything to tell good about it. It's just my own views and I paid the full price for this upgrade. So yeah, let's get back to the video. Now let's first talk about the business class lounge. So if you have a business class or first class ticket, you can just walk into the Emirates business class or first class lounge. You do not have to go to the regular security gate and wait with the economy passengers. And in this lounge, I mean Emirates makes one of the best lounge, airport lounge in the world I guess. They have been awarded for a lot of times as well. And in this lounge you can get unlimited food, drinks, you can eat, sleep, drink, surf, unlimited internet. Everything is just unlimited, go mad at it. And talking about the first track check-in, almost all of the airports have the Emirates business class and first class lounge right next to the boarding gate. So the business of first class customers can straight up walk the upper deck of the aircraft without waiting or going to the economy hall and even if you are someone who is waiting at the economy hall you can still get to the first track there are like two queues one is for the economy and the second is for business and the first class just get on that first track queue and you can reach your seat straight away and for the extra features as a business class or first class ticket holder you are going to get a lot of features like you get extra baggage allowance you get extra hand carry allowance you get free unlimited internet you get a free chauffeur Dubai drop for the hotel and you get free unlimited food, drinks, access to the onboard lounge and fast track for check-in and baggage board. That is crazy. Alright, it seems my boarding time is on. It's 9.25. It's already 9.20 right now. I will be going to the fast track anyways. And I was not allowed to film in the Los Angeles to Mumbai flight due to some security reasons. But I have the permission to film inside this Dubai to Mumbai flight. So let's go see the flight now. You need to check if you have got mango juice or something. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't have, then apple is fine. Yeah. 
mango juice yeah. with ice? Yeah. Sure, yeah. sure. No worries. Thank you. All right. I just got my mango juice. My food has reached at the Paneer Butter Mashana, Chole, <laughs> rice, chicken, one kind of bread sandwich, mango picnic. Just have the food. And the best thing is about the internet. For the business and first class customers, you get free unlimited internet all throughout the flight, which is like chargeable $16 for the economy. So, internet is my lifeline. Without internet, nothing works for me. And you have to bear with me for this review because I have to speak low. Everyone is sleeping out here. It's like 2 a.m. right now. So, and there are no lights, absolutely. No lights, silence, pin drop silence. Everyone is sleeping. I have to speak low. Bear with me for the review. So, Emirates has been awarded as the best airlines in the world when it comes to entertainment. They call it ICE Information, Communication and Entertainment. It's just loaded with thousands and thousands of movies, music, songs games, TV series, I mean, yeah, and it's all free, you can just watch any movie, any TV series, play any games for absolutely free, I mean, if you're getting bored in Emirates flight, you must be seriously depressed with your life. And talking about entertainment, you get this huge 23 inch screen, you can just play any movie, it starts with movie on, and you get this nice tablet, you just this get off and you can just watch the movies right in the tablet do anything play games listen to music this tablet also you get this small remote you can use this to play games use it as a controller and just do anything you want right from the controller so entertainment is pretty much loaded in a 3 it is all the time big screen a huge tablet remote control when you're sleeping like you can do pretty much everything now talking about the design for the business class in a380 it's designed as one to one format so the window side like this is the one config and the middle is with two config which is best suited for like for couples and friends who are flying together but normally whenever i'm like flying alone i always choose the one config that is a window side because yeah it just feels so private to me so whenever i can i just go ahead and upgrade it's just so comfortable. Now, talking about the space, it's huge. The private space for one seat of a business class in A380 is absolutely huge. It makes sense why it's so expensive. This is a completely flat bed. So right now it's on 90 degrees. There you can see that it has all those buttons. This button pulls me forward, backward config. This is the whole 180 degree. This is the 120 degree and this is the 90 degree. So right now it's on 90 degree. Let me show it to you. Uh, let's try the 120. Yeah, so it's set to 120. This is the 120. And now let's try the 180. Completely flat bed. Let's do it. Get back to the 90 degree. All the way from 180 to 90 degree. And each seat of the A3D business class comes with a lot of storage. Storage box, storage box, storage box, huge space. Also storage. Over here, you can see I have placed my phone and the lens cap. A lot of storage. And with every seat of the A3 config, you get this mini bar. It has a lot of drinks, water, a 
Pepsi, Melinda, mango juice, but it doesn't serve alcohol. For the alcohol, you need to go to the onboard lounge. I'm going to show you right now. So this mini bar is really neat, and they also restock it like in every half of the flight in case it's done. It's over, they need to restock it. How cool is that? And the power socket options. You are going to get everything right in. You can use those sockets charge your laptop. You can use those sockets for the headphones, you can use those sockets for phone, iPhone, Android phones, everything. So pretty much all set. Now what all you get in the business class of the 80 First you get is this noise cancellation headphones, one huge blanket, one huge pillow and the big menu book. It has a lot of options. So basically this space is all about you. It's completely for yourself. Flat bed dedicated place to keep your boots space so over there and if you need light like I'm crying right now for a lot of light you are going to get like two or three options for the light first is this big light for yourself and then these two lights all three lights are your friend when it's like completely dark and for the window panes like this in my seat I have two panes this and this I can just use those buttons and get it done. Or I have those three small buttons to manage it. This is for one, this is for left, this is for right and this is for both. Here is how it works. deck of Emirates A380 airplanes only available for the business and first class. You get unlimited drinks, beverages, I just had a lot of mango juice. Just reached Mumbai, was really tired, went ahead, slept for a while, got ready, changed the dress and I know many of you are going to ask about the pricing for the business class. Let me tell you, they are really expensive and for the first class, they are super expensive. So if you really want to know about the pricing idea, just go to Emirates website, use the search form, put in your dates and you can pretty much see the pricing. Now how to get the best offer for business class upgrades? First, if you're someone who cannot settle with economy, then just go ahead and book the business class because you never know it's sold out for most of the time. Second, if you're a risk taker like me, get the economy, wait for the business class upgrade options. Normally what I do is just before 48 hours I check in and look for the upgrade options. It normally flashes on the website itself. And if you're someone who is a frequent flyer, make sure you are having the Emirates Skywards membership. It's absolutely amazing. I have one. So every time you're flying with Emirates, you're accumulating a lot of Skyward points, which can you really use it for upgrade as well. Pro tip, do not use third party websites to get the Emirates tickets because you're not going to be able to use those flights for Skyward members or Skyward miles. Second, the business class seating arrangement is kind of tricky. Just try to get a seat which is towards the window because that is the one which is the one config, you have, if you're choosing the middle one, that is again two config, so it's not going to be that much private. So always I would suggest to select the window side because it's one config and you're really going to feel private as well. So that's my detailed review about the Emirates A380 business class. If you have got any questions, just let me know in the comment section below. I just cannot wait to fly next with them for my next destination, my next road trip. So yeah, just let me know in the comment section below if you have got any questions, smash the subscribe button if you haven't done yet and don't forget to click on the bell icon to stay updated. I will see you next. Wish. You were passing by, surrounded by all those butterflies, suddenly they flew right in my eyes.